Hey everyone, I'm here in Chester's room. There's beautiful art behind me and I'm here to talk to you about having an awesome and safe sun god party. I know it's next weekend and we're gearing up for sun god and it's the fifth year that I've been here in San Diego for sun god so I think I know a little bit about what I'm talking about. Last year I threw like a small kickback but it went pretty well. So obviously let me talk about um, some of the important things you want to have to have a good party. Um, obvi uh, so obviously you're going to have to have appetizers because people are going to be hungry, especially if they've been drinking during the day already and they get to your house at like 5 or 6 and they're ready for food. So um, last year what I did is I bought like a huge like Costco sized tub of animal crackers and those disappeared. I bought guacamole and chips, those disappeared. I recommend, um, I really like the the flaxseed chips of Trader Joe's just because they're multicolored so they look really cool. Sorry I didn't bring it back, I should have thought this through. <laughs> and um, I also like the blue corn chips, I think you can get them at Ralph's, you can get them at Whole Foods, pretty much anywhere around the La Jolla area. Um, and then also I had like a cheese and meat um, selection, I know you're like ooh high class but um, Honestly, most of it I just bought at Ralph's and like cut it up and like put it on a cutting board and it looked cool. So um, that's just a cool idea. And then I really splurged. I went to Sprinkles and bought like a half dozen cupcakes and everyone like cut them up and split them and they were amazing. I think that was the highlight of the party. So other than um, the alcohol, of course, which is the last but most important ingredient. So um, usually Ralph's like sells out within the day or two before. So I really suggest like going to like BevMo or somewhere that's going to have a really good selection because everyone's going to want something different. So um, I really recommend, let's see, what did we do last year? Last year we made margaritas with tequila. That was really awesome. I got like a margarita mix. Um, let's see, we also did, I mean a lot of people like Jack, uh, I don't particularly like Jack and Coke, so I don't usually buy that. Um, Hypnotic is like a good universal drink, I think, because um, people like me that are wimpy will drink it, and then like someone who's more intense will finish off the rest of the bottle. So I think that goes well. Um, so yeah, I think there's lots of options out there now. Um, I also like schnapps, but that's just personal preference. So uh, just basically like have a list when you go and get your stuff like I don't know I, I usually end up bringing home a lot more drinks than I ever use and then I have them in my fridge for months so yes it's better to have more than less because you don't want to run out but um just I don't know plan ahead think this through <laughs> so uh, but anyways having to do with alcohol I found this like fun little pamphlet on campus it says Sun God says Triton's party safe or safer. So it's just like talking about like um uh what to do if you have a friend that gets alcohol poisoning, which sucks but is unfortunately a necessary evil of Sun God. So um I guess I'll put the link up for this just so you can read through this if you're curious as to what to do if you have a problem, especially if you're hosting the party at your house because Usually the host has to deal with these things, let's be honest. So, um, yeah, just uh, this is important. And obviously have a fun and safe Friday. And, um, you know, have a great time. Um, enjoy before finals hit. And congrats on people that have finished their midterms. But, yeah, so that's pretty much Sun God. Um, usually, like, everyone comes to my house and we do parking and then we take the shuttle. Um, and then actually last year my friends ended up walking back from campus to my house without the shuttle because it was so busy. So recommendation, uh, leave Sun God before 10. I know no one wants to do that but the shuttle just gets crazy. So those are just my little tips, tidbits I guess of Sun God. Um, obviously if you live on campus a lot of this doesn't apply to you because you know yeah, I'm not supposed to have this stuff, but, um, other fun little facts, um, it's better to throw the party in your room than in your living room where the RA can come in and see, so, <laughs> yeah, uh, so enjoy next weekend, and, uh, yeah, don't forget to subscribe, I have lots more 
videos coming out, so thanks so much.